Ginny, why is my office dirty? Where is the cleaner? I'm so sorry, sir. The cleaner left. She won't be working here anymore. What do you mean she left? Why? She had some personal issues at her place, so she had to quit. Why didn't you hire someone? Do I have to handle everything around here? I'm really sorry. I will start looking for a replacement right away. Make sure it's done quickly. I don't want this to happen again. Good morning, ma'am. How can I help you? Hello, my name is Maya. I'm here because I really need work. Do you have any job openings? I'm sorry, Maya, but we don't have any job vacancies at the moment. Please, I really need a job. I'm willing to do anything, any kind of work. I can't leave without some help. Well, we do have a cleaning position available. It's not much, but if you can clean the entire office before 9 a.m., we could hire you for that. Yes, I can do that. I don't mind. I'm ready to work. All right then. You will need to come in early and make sure everything is spotless before the staff arrives. Can you manage that? Absolutely. I will be here every morning, no problem. Thank you so much for this opportunity. No problem at all. We will start you tomorrow. Where is Maya, Sanju? Is she in the kitchen? No, mom. She went out to look for a job. A job? But why? Who is going to take care of you if she is working? Mom, we are running out of money. Maya has been so stressed about it, so she is trying to find work to support us. Oh, my poor boy. I'm so sorry. I didn't realize things were that bad. I have a little money saved up. I can give you some to help out. No, Mom. You keep your money. He barely gives you enough as it is. I don't want you to struggle because of me. But you are my son. I can't just stand by and watch you both suffer. We will manage. Maya is doing everything she can, and we will figure this out. Hello. Where are you? I'm at my son's place. What happened? What happened? Why didn't you make lunch? What am I supposed to eat? There is food in the fridge. Just heat it up. There is no food in the fridge. Get back here as soon as possible. All right, I will come back soon. You better be quick. What happened? He wants me to come home. I have to go my son. You know how he is, a very high temper man. Mom, are you happy with him? Why don't you leave him and move in with us? You don't have to stay with someone like him. I get it, you go ahead. Maya. Maya? Maya? Can you hear me? Hmm. What is it, Sunju? I'm hungry. Can you please make me something to eat? I'm so tired. 
Please let me sleep for a while. I will make something later. But, Maya, I haven't eaten. I really need food. I can't wait much longer. Maya? Is that you? Yes, I'm Maya. How do you know my name? Don't you remember me? We met at the hospital. I was there with my mother, and we spoke in the hallway. Oh, yes. Now I remember. You are Rohan, right? That's right. But what are you doing here? Why are you cleaning? Well, I needed a job. My husband had an accident and can't work anymore. So I had to start earning money to support him and cover his medical expenses. I'm really sorry to hear that. But Maya, you shouldn't be doing this kind of work. This is my office. I'm the owner. I can offer you a better position. This is your office? But I don't mind cleaning. I need the money, and I don't have any work experience. No, I won't let you work as a cleaner. Are you educated? Yes, I studied, but I have never really worked before. That's fine. How about becoming my assistant? You can help me manage things here. It's much better than cleaning, and you will get a decent salary. Your assistant? Are you sure I can do it? I'm sure you can. I'll help you with the tasks, and you'll learn as we go. What do you say? Thank you so much, Rohan. I don't know how to thank you. This means a lot to me. Sanju, you don't look well today. Is everything okay? You seem a bit down. Yes, I'm fine, Dr. Anna. Just tired, that's all. Are you sure? You have been pushing yourself a lot. It's okay to feel overwhelmed sometimes, but don't lose hope. I guess. I just feel like it's going to take forever. Don't worry too much, Sanju. If you keep doing your best, I'm confident you will walk again. I have seen many patients like you, Sanju. People who suffered from spinal injuries, and many of them recovered. You have a real chance, but you have to stay positive and keep working hard. I will do my best, Dr. Anna. I just want to walk again. That's all I think about. 